and so it begins. Where am I? I am at the top of Lake Avenue in Altadena, which is just northeast of downtown Los Angeles. There's a storm coming in, and I don't get the opportunity to go up into the mountains too often. So I figured I would kill two birds with one stone and uh, go up into the mountains while there's a storm coming in. I'm going to take this fire break, and this is just the tip of the iceberg, what you can see here. Uh, so I'm going to take the fire road, which they bulldozed in uh, 2009, I believe, when the fires were ripping through the San Gabriels. It goes straight up the mountain just like that. Okay, maybe like that. It's still steep. Take the horseshoe bend around over to Echo Mountain over there, and then take the Castle Canyon Trail up to Inspiration Point and find a place to camp up there. All right, so I'll take you guys along with me and maybe we'll get some uh, good views of this storm coming in. And here's just another view of that iceberg. But again, it's just the second tip. There's more. So that is the ruins of the old hotel on Echo Mountain, just across the ridge. People used to get dressed up in suits and their Victorian dresses with the necks that went up to their ears and come up here, ride a train up there and uh, enjoy the view. A whole bunch of wussies if you ask me. But uh, it burnt down, I don't know, in the early 1900s and uh, they dismantled the railroad and so now it's just a relic of what it once was. And it's a uh, destination for hikers now. So I'm almost where I wanted to be. And where I'm going is where those trees are on the top of the ridge up in the high mountain that's uh, in the clouds right now. So I'll let you guys know when I get there. So I've gotten a little bit higher. It is 4.54 right now. And I've got about, about three and a half, four more miles to go. The sun sets today at like 5.50. So I've got a little under an hour before the sun sets. And I don't think that I can make it there on that amount of time, especially with a grade like this. Uh, looking up, it's like that. I'll show you guys what level is here. So, <laughs> I've got a mountain to climb, but I'll do okay. I got rain gear and food and a stove and all that stuff, so I should be okay. Here's a view of what I'm seeing right now. So this is looking out over the San Gabriel Valley. So we have like Temple City, uh, Arcadia over there, then further south, the City of Industry. Rosemead, Whittier, down where those mountains are. Uh, way in the distance, I don't know if you can see that, but that's uh, Saddleback Mountain down in Orange County. And over here, this is close to the mountain. This is the beautiful town of Altadena. And then further down where all those cities are the closer uh, commercial area, that's uh, Pasadena, Old Town Pasadena, Colorado Boulevard. Uh, and then we have uh, downtown LA uh, over there. City of La Cañada and Jet Propulsion Laboratory here. Glendale's on the other side. Yeah, so a beautiful view. I'd probably get there faster if I didn't take so much time taking these dang videos. So I'll try and record while I'm walking in the meantime and uh, make up some of that lost time. Oh goody, that looks fun. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm sweating a whole bunch right now. It's getting in my eyes, making them sting and burn. There's one thing I wish I had right now. The hat bandana combo. <sighs> that way I could wipe the sweat out of my eyes. <sighs> Next time. Oh. Okay, so normally I would be going up that. I see where those rocks are, that little rock ridge that goes up. Real steep, it's a scramble. Normally I would do that. I don't want to do that today, I'm tired. I got a big pack on, I've never done it. It's a little bit sketchy, so I'm not gonna do that today. So instead, at this fork in the road, 
right here. I'm gonna take the left, go to where the road is, and take the road up behind and around, and it'll come back. It'll take me a little longer, but it's safer, and I like being safe. I got something to show you guys. That is just beautiful. It also looks like that's the last sun I'm gonna get for the day. So uh, from here on out, I better get ready for snow. Now I have to get to the other side of that hill and go up through one of those canyons on that side. It's gonna be pretty steep, but I signed up for this and I'm not giving up. Very well marked Castle Canyon Trail. That's where I'm going. Into the mountains. Right there. And now into the forest I go to lose my mind and find my soul. So as you can see, the light is dwindling and I'm well on my way up that mountain. Probably got about a mile to go to the top, but it is a tough mile. Castle Canyon Trail is not for the faint hearted. As I'm climbing in altitude, I can feel it getting colder. I'm starting to lose the feeling in my thumbs, so I've got to pay attention to that before it gets so cold that my fingers don't work and I can't pinch open my zippers on my pack. Also, as it gets dark, I wanna keep an eye out for mountain lions. They hunt at dusk and dawn and uh, they're stealth hunters, ambush predators. So likely I could pass within six feet of one and not notice they're so quiet. In the 18 years that I've been hiking in these mountains. I've never seen one, so I'm waiting for it. Hopefully I see it from afar. And here we are, inspiration point. That was a good hike, eh? Aw oh, man, I gotta go to work tomorrow. Shoot. Been a while since I've seen snow. Okay, now I wanna be on the lookout for any large animal tracks. Just to be safe, not because I'm too worried about it, but just to be aware. Looks like we have some deer tracks here. A day old. Looks like the snow has melted since they've been through. I don't know if you can see, but we got a bunny crossing this, this way right here. I like the snow because you can tell what animals have been by. It keeps their tracks really nice. Okay. Looks like I found my spot. So I'm all set up in here, and it's pretty cold. I'd say maybe high 30s, you can see my breath. But uh, it's not too windy, and it said there's a 95% chance of rain at about 10 o'clock, it's about 7.30 right now. Hopefully it's a good storm. I staked my tent down. I hope that it's not going to be too windy, but I hope it's a little windy. Cause yeah. so I didn't want to come up here for nothing. I guess we'll see. Well, I'll do my best with the house lights I got here. This isn't exactly the ball busting, rip you off the side of the mountain storm that I was expecting. But hey, you don't always get what you want. Sometimes I like to remind myself why I like to sleep in a warm bed. Tonight's one of those nights. It's about 4.30 right now and I have work at 8. So I'm gonna hike down for two hours and go home and take a shower and maybe catch a wink of sleep and then go to work. All right, that's a wrap. Cut.